Kia ora team, my name's Ben, and today let's talk about the hormonal control of glucose or sugar. We got lots of lots of funky words on the board that we'll go through. First step, if I wake up in the morning and I haven't eaten for a while, then my blood sugar is going to be low. So this is called hypoglycemia. Hypo, low, gly, sugar, emia, blood. Awesome. So what does this trigger? So if my blood glucose is low, the hormone that gets released is glucagon. Glucagon comes from our pancreas and it's released from the alpha cells. It comes into the blood and then glucagon comes over to the liver and it stimulates these things. So glycogenolysis, glycogen is stored sugar. So if our blood sugar is low, we want to break that down and bring it back into the cell. So glycogen, stored sugar, lysis, break down. Good tip. All right, then the other thing it does is gluconeogenesis. Gluco, sugar, neo, new, genesis, like the first book in the Bible, creation. So this is where we create new sugar from non-carbohydrate sources. We can use fat and protein to make sugar and then release it into the blood. So if we do these things, hopefully my blood sugar levels rise back up to normal and then the pancreas is gonna stop releasing glucagon because we're now nice and homeostasis. Okay, the opposite. If, if I go to the bakery and I eat lots of gorgeous sugary carby foods, then my intestines are going to absorb the carbohydrate. They all get broken down into glucose in the blood. So now we're going to have increased blood glucose. So hyper, increased more than. Gly, glucose, emia, blood. What happens then is our pancreas releases insulin from our beta cells. Insulin comes into the blood vessel. And insulin is like the key that unlocks the door for glucose to enter the cell. Insulin release, unlock the door, glucose now enters the cell. And so blood glucose levels are going to fall back to a normal level. And then insulin stops getting released. So what else does it do? So it allows glucose to enter the cell. Glycogenesis. So glycogen was stored sugar. So if we've, got, if we've got too much sugar in the blood, we're going to take it into the cells. If we've got all the sugar we need, then we're going to store it. So we can store it in the muscle or we can store it in the liver. And the creation, genesis, of stored sugar, glycogen, is glycogenesis. So insulin is going to do that as well. And if our glycogen stores are full, so we've got all the sugar we need in our blood, then we've got all the sugar we need in our muscles and our liver, then what to do with the extra sugar? Lipogenesis, lipid fat genesis creation. So insulin is gonna also cause the creation of fat in our fat cells. All right team, that's our normal homeostatic regulation of blood glucose. Happy studying. <laughs>